Curse in front, Ukrainian sources say that the Ukrainian troops are advancing in Tomonobaka and Chornobaevka direction. Fighting continues around Kisilivka and Molodetsk. Yesterday, there was an unconfirmed report about Ukrainian troops being around 10 kilometers west of Kherson, which would put Ukrainian forces somewhere near Chornobaevka. Papasna Front, Russian troops, made progress on the southern part of Papasna Front by capturing Krynikny and Myronivka 16 kilometers south of Papasna. However, their actions on the northern part of the front weren't as successful, as the attempts to break through in Mykolaivka and Vrbivka were stopped. Russian troops, gained ground in Tashkivka, and now control most of the town. From Tashkivka, Russians tried to attack up north, but were once again pushed back near Ustinivka. Severodonetsk, Russian sources claim that, in Azat plant there are up to 2.5 thousand servicemen, of which up to 20 to 25 percent are foreign mercenaries. Head of Ukrainian Luhansk administration, Suri Gaidi said that all the bridges leading to Severodonetsk have been destroyed. But the city is not fully blockaded, and part of it is under Ukrainian control. Ukraine asked for a humanitarian corridor for the evacuation of civilians from Severodonetsk to Lysychansk. Russia accepted and the corridor is opening on June 15. But it will be carried out in the northern direction to Svetovo in LPR. Izium Front, according to Ukrainian sources, Ukrainian troops kept pushing east and captured the village of Prydonetsk located in the forest west of Izium. If the reports are true, Ukrainian forces are now just 10 kilometers west of Izium. Southeast of Izium, Russian troops fully captured Dovan. Ukrainian troops had to withdraw in order to avoid getting encircled from behind, in Mazanivka's direction. It is now confirmed that Russian troops have captured northwestern outskirts of Bohorodik, but Ukrainians are still in control of southern parts of the town. Kharkiv Front Russian sources, reported that Russian artillery is shelling Ukrainian positions in, Shestikov, Paramoha, Steriai Saltiv and in southern outskirts of Rubizn, indicating that these areas are under Ukrainian control. 